Good morning. I am proud to be the principal of the glorious Govins Elementary School and part of such a privileged occasion. I trust that this new building will help us prepare our students for college and career readiness. The staff at Govins Elementary School is excited about making an impact on the lives of our students. I have visited Govins. Um, fabulous instruction there happening for kids and when I think of uh, the buildings that these young people are going to be going to. Uh, it just kind of came over me in a wave when I walked through this morning. The Govan staff looks forward to utilizing our 21st century learning space, collaborative learning areas, a media center, a multi-purpose gymnasium with a basketball and volleyball court, a cafetorium with a dedicated AV system, a production studio, a technology lab equipped with a device for every student classrooms that include interactive display panels and microphones. The list goes on and on. I am Ella Standridge and I am a fifth grade student at Govins Elementary School. On a personal note, I would like to thank all the engineers involved in planning for the new school building. I aspire to be an engineer when I grow up. You heard already, if you've been to Gobins Elementary, some of the greatest and most community involved young people that I've ever had the pleasure of being around, who made me come up to their school and help them clean up and down York Road, who talked to me about how they want to have a better city, how they think we can have a, a city where they can be safe, what they want to be, engineers and everything else. We would not have these new buildings today, Tuesday, the ones that are to come and the ones that have already opened. If thousands of black, brown, and white parents, students, community activists, alumni, and teachers had not advocated and demonstrated over the course of years for educational equity and modern school buildings for the families of Baltimore City.